Are you getting triggered by things that are going on in the world right now? Are you able to keep your inner peace? The peace that passeth understanding. You own it. It's yours. You're a child of God. You are made in the image and likeness of God. And when you know that, you can watch the movie as it unfolds and have that inner peace and know what to do moment to moment in order to rise above whatever comes along you don't have to get down into it you can transform it and that's why you're here at this time because you're one of the ones that came here to help with the transformation the awakening but keep yourself centered i talked about my magic notebook technique the other day well if you take that magic notebook and every morning for 30 days, you sit down, once you've figured out what it is that you're working on, that one thing that will gratify you, make your life so much better, <clears throat> whatever it is. And if you write every, every morning when you wake up a story around that, that you can look at and go, I feel it. I believe it. It's me. And you just keep writing and writing and writing for 30 days. It will raise your consciousness and create the state that you want to be in to make that thing happen. Because nothing ever happens as long as you're wanting it. You have to be it. You have to become it. You have to believe it. And when you can do that by going within and feeling like it's already happened, it happens. That's why I did my course, the Mega Manifestation Method. If you go look at that course on my website, RebeccaTrip.com, you can actually put it on your phone by getting the Kajabi app. And um, I get inspired when I listen to the, the videos that I made because they're all meant to lift your consciousness to that place where you can live the better version of yourself, the you that is already living the better version of yourself. You just need to step into it, own it, claim it, and you will become it because that's how it works. Whatever you believe with your innermost being is what you're experiencing in your life. So I challenge you to just take a look at that, go to my website and um, start living it.